This is also another gesture as a reason for the presidency of President Jawaharlal Nehru and the government of Pakistan uh, as a, a token of sympathy, uh, of friendship, and solidarity to the just struggle of the Pakistan people. I <coughs> wish to thank His Excellency for his uh, kind words of welcome. Indeed, uh, it is an honor for me to come here and uh, to visit Kampuchea and to present my credentials to His Royal Highness Sambuk's Ceremony, which, as uh, His Excellency has said, uh, is uh, another manifestation of our solidarity and support to to present His Excellency the copies of the letters. Uh, one is the letter of recall of my predecessor who was accredited to Democratic Kampuchea. And uh, the other is the copy of my credentials. I also have here the text of the short speech uh, I shall make just before presenting my credentials.
community cannot accept the gross violation of the fundamental principles of interstate relations reflected in the foreign interventions in Cambodia and Afghanistan. Pakistan, like the bulk of mankind, will continue to uphold the right of the people of these countries to sovereignty and independence, which can be exercised only after the foreign occupation forces have been withdrawn. I take this opportunity to convey to Your High Highness and through you to the valiant and gifted people of Kampuchea, when all countries, great and small, can run Your Excellency, Mr. Ambassador, first of all, may I express my most profound gratitude to your great leader, His Excellency Zia Ulha, President of the Islam Republic of Pakistan, for our homeland by foreign occupation, occupying forces. Now, His Excellency, the President of Pakistan, is so good as to accredit Your Excellency as the Ambassador Extraordinaire et Plénipotentiaire du Pakistan auprès du Kampuchea Démocratique. Indeed, it is for the state, the people, the government of Democratic Kampuchea a great honor and a new proof that the glorious Islamic Republic of Pakistan is always on our side since she upholds always the principle of justice, of freedom for all peoples and support for all oppressed or aggressed people like our Kampuchea now, which is the victim of the neo-imperialism and colonialism of a foreign country, a neighbor whom we used to support when that neighbor had to fight for his freedom and independence. We appreciate very much the very noble activities of His Excellency, the President of Pakistan, his government, and all the delegation of Pakistan at the UN and everywhere all over the world. You are always working not only to defend the interest of your great country and great nation and people, but you are working hard and fighting hard in the international arenas in order to help brotherly peoples like the Afghan and the Kampuchean people who are being aggressed and invaded by foreign powers. We, may I pay homage on behalf of my country and my government and people to His Excellency the President of Pakistan and to your government, to your nation and people, Mr. Ambassador, for your very valuable help 
to Kampuchea and also to Afghanistan. As you told us a few minutes ago, Pakistan has to protect and to give hospitality, a very nice and generous hospitality indeed, to more than three million refugees from Afghanistan. Close to our headquarters here uh, is the glorious kingdom of Thailand. And Thailand, like uh, Pakistan, is uh, so good as to accept on her soil and to protect and help in every way more than 200,000 Kampuchean refugees. Why Pakistan and Thailand have so many refugees on their soil from neighboring countries? It is because our two peoples, the Afghan people and the Kampuchean people, reject definitely the uh, Soviet imperialism and colonialism and uh, the Vietnamese imperialism and colonialism. So they cannot live under the yoke of those foreign powers. As members of the United Nations Organization, the Soviet Union and the Socialist, Socialist Republic of Vietnam must abide by the resolutions of the United Nations uh, on Afghanistan and on Kampuchea. But contrary to it, they decide to stay, to colonize uh, deep uh, Afghanistan on the one hand and Kampuchea on the other hand. So, uh, as I have the honor to tell you, Excellency, a few minutes ago, the Afghan people and the Kampuchean people, they are determined to resist against the occupying foreign forces till the day they accept to abide by the resolutions on Afghanistan and on Kampuchea uh, of the United Nations organization and they accept to withdraw totally and unconditionally their troops from our countries. As far as mine is concerned, I can assure you that we will always uh, uh, be grateful to your great country and great leader uh, for uh, their very noble support and uh, very efficient support. And the fact that your excellency is here today in one of our liberated areas, in one of our uh, headquarters, uh, is a very uh, important and clear proof that uh, Pakistan uh, is determined to go on in the process of helping Kampuchea to liberate herself and to become once again, like uh, in the past, a sovereign, neutral, non-aligned and peaceful state, nation and the country. We are determined, we Kampuchians, uh, to uh, go on uh, in the process of liberating our country. It is uh, true that uh, for the time being, we have not yet a very big uh, army. Our coalition armed forces uh, are increasing in number and in experience. Uh, we uh, have, we refuse to go backward. We are determined to go forward and uh, in the months and the years to come, we will do our best in order to strengthen the uh, armed forces and to equip always uh, better and better uh, and to increase the number of the fighting units of uh, the coalition armed forces in order 
to uh, make the Vietnamese understand that they will never uh, be uh, at, in peace uh, in Cambodia. They will never feel at home in Cambodia. We do not want to interfere in the affairs of the Vietnamese, but the only thing we ask for is uh, to have the Vietnamese in Vietnam and to have the Kampuchians in Kampuchea. It is uh, uh, all our uh, policy and philosophy. And uh, I know that His Excellency, President Zia Haq, his government and your great people and nation understand us and approve of uh, such a policy and a reasonable, reasonable stand. So in, that is in these feelings that uh, I request Your Excellency to convey to His Excellency, the President of Pakistan, my best respectful uh, and affectionate regards and my fervent wishes for uh, his happiness and the great uh, complete success of his historic mission as the head of the state and the nation of glorious Pakistan. Uh, may I finally uh, request your excellency to accept uh, my gratitude, the expression of my most profound gratitude for coming here and presenting your credentials here uh, in uh, uncomfortable conditions, but uh, uh, we are doing our best with all my heart to welcome your excellency, our people, you saw them, they are very enthusiastic, so happy and grateful to you, Mr. Ambassador, and uh, uh, we, the coalition government, and President of Democratic Kampuchea, uh, we will uh, always uh, support uh, Your Excellency in your noble endeavors. And uh, you have and will have always our full support uh, in order uh, to make your mission uh, in uh, Kampuchea, Democratic Kampuchea, as the very distinguished uh, ambassador of Pakistan, uh, very, very successful. Uh, so, may I uh, say, to conclude, long live Pakistan, long live uh, the very beautiful friendship uniting uh, democratic Kampuchea and the Islamic Republic of Pakistan, our two peoples and two governments.
not uh, your your coming here is very uh, glorious uh, uh, adventure, <laughs> if I may say so, because uh, the day we can meet in Phnom Penh, that means that uh, uh, our uh, liberation war <laughs> and struggle are over. <laughs> so uh, the diplomatic life. <laughs> becomes once again normal, <laughs> normal. <laughs> but uh, but now <laughs> yes. the ambassadors who come here, <laughs> they they are heroes <laughs> <laughs> to present credentials. You know, uh, in Phnom Penh is uh, good, <laughs> will be very good. But <laughs> but uh, here it is uh, even better <laughs> because the enemy. It's not so far, not so far away, 40 kilometers, 40 kilometers. Uh, but uh, our armed forces, they are very successful. Yes. Uh, they can uh, give uh, to the distinguished diplomats who come and have relations with us. They are uh, all guarantees. I, I have the original of my speech. <laughs> May I sign for your excellency from, it is a, uh, the the uh, original uh, yeah, souvenir, the, <laughs> souvenir the, uh, working working uh, uh, paper yes yes so uh, uh, that will be a great uh, souvenir from you Original paper. Yes. So I, I prepare, but I prepare. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, that is it for me. Very precious. Very precious. Yeah. <laughs> it is. Uh, it is the hot se uh, uh, season now, but uh, the rainy season is coming. Very happy and honored to have an interview, a very friendly and fraternal interview with Thai and Chinese correspondents, distinguished representatives of Thailand's press and China's press. I'm at your disposal. Please put your questions. What's your further progress in your in Kampuchea? In Kampuchea, I have to go in a few days 
to another uh, uh, place, to another uh, uh, liberated uh, zone, to see my followers there, civilians and military. Uh, I have to bring um, humani humanitarian aid uh, to them. And uh, I have to visit uh, teams of the last uh, dry season uh, offensive by the Vietnamese forces. As I told the press, uh, uh, they did not uh, succeed in killing, uh, um, wiping out our armed resistance, uh, killing our soldiers, but uh, they uh, have killed uh, many uh, civilian refugees, including women and the children. And I had to visit a hospital uh, with uh, wounded uh, women, children, people. Uh, they uh, are civilians. Uh, they were uh, the victims of the war. Yeah. I got uh, humanitarian aid from uh, the government of uh, China on the one hand and of uh, the government of uh, Korea, the Democratic Peace Republic of Korea on the other hand. So I uh, bring uh, the two uh, humanitarian aid, the Chinese aid and uh, the Korean aid to uh, my compatriots. This aid include food and medicine and other things? Yes, yes, and uh, yes, close. Uh, clothes and uh, food and uh, other, other materials uh, for their life, you know, in the, in the jungle, because uh, they need the uh, In favor of our government, 90 vote, uh, in uh, 1981, that was uh, there were there were uh, 77, and uh, last year we got 90 uh, votes in favor of our government, uh, government of Democratic Capuchia, and uh, uh, in 1981 we got uh, 100 votes in favor of the resolution on Capuchia of the UN. And we got uh, last year uh, five uh, votes more, that is to say 105. And I have to express my gratitude to ASEAN and to China, uh, to Pakistan, to all other uh, friendly countries upholding uh, the principle of justice and freedom, uh, who uh, all they uh, help uh, us a lot uh, in every field and at the UN uh, that was our success, the success of our coalition, the results of the forming of the coalition but the result also of the noble efforts made by ASEAN in particular and uh, all the other uh, friendly countries uh, uh, to uh, help us uh, in uh, at the UN in the diplomatic and political field. And uh, uh, finally, uh, we have uh, other achievements because uh, inside the Kampuchea we get uh, uh, more support than before when, when we were divided as a patriotic movement. We could not get uh, a very strong support from our people since uh, we were divided. But now our people see, on the one hand, that the Vietnamese, they are not coming into Cambodia in order to save them, but uh, to colonize and Vietnamize uh, their homeland. And on the other hand, they see that uh, there is a coalition, a very symbol of the unity uh, uh, of our nation and our determination to go on fighting till the day we uh, uh, wipe out all Vietnamese presence and we uh, succeed in liberating 100% our homeland, 
uh, our territorial integrity. So uh, we get uh, 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 strong, strong support uh, from from our people inside inside uh, Kampuchea. As I told His Excellency, the Ambassador of Pakistan, a few minutes ago, you know, uh, we have always, uh, and I uh, in particular, always uh, enjoy uh, the uh, support of uh, uh, the peasants of our people in the countryside. Uh, but uh, now in towns, uh, even in Phnom Penh, we have more and more supporters. Uh, because the citizens there, uh, they see now the realities. Uh, they see that uh, uh, our government is really very national because all the patriotic forces, they are united. They are in the government. And on the other hand, uh, they see that the Vietnamese, uh, uh, they are coming in Kampuchea not to help uh, uh, them, but uh, <laughs> to uh, uh, Vietnamese. Uh, the homeland, uh, they are uh, uh, importing, if I may say so, uh, you know, more and more uh, settlers from Vietnam. They have uh, almost 200,000 military uh, uh, soldiers in Kampuchea, and their withdrawal, I told you, uh, was uh, just uh, uh, to deceive. Uh, the, uh, the international community. There was uh, no, uh, no real withdrawal. Uh, rather a rotation of troops, they replaced tired troops uh, units uh, by uh, with, with uh, uh, fresh uh, units. And uh, on the other hand, uh, our people see that now there are more than 300,000 settlers, Vietnamese, taking our lands, uh, exploiting our natural resources. So uh, uh, the people, even in towns, uh, are uh, very angry vis-à-vis uh, -vis the Vietnamese. So I think that uh, those are our achievements, the achievements uh, of the coalition government. And uh, uh, I must mention also the fact that uh, uh, more and more ambassadors from abroad are coming. They come to the liberated zone to our headquarters here, and uh, I have had the honor uh, of uh, receiving already uh, uh, six ambassadors, five uh, the other day, uh, from uh, Malaysia, China, Bangladesh, uh, uh, the Democratic People's Republic of Korea, uh, Mauritania, and uh, now, uh, from Pakistan, His Excellency, the Ambassador of Pakistan is coming, and uh, I uh, am sure that in the future I uh, will have the honor and pleasure uh, to receive uh, other ambassadors from ASEAN and from other very uh, friend friendly countries. Uh, so uh, each time there are ambassadors, new ambassadors, who uh, would like to present credentials to me in my capacity as president of Democratic Kampuchea, I'm ready to, <laughs> to come here to receive uh, the credentials. And uh, it, it is, it is uh, the result of uh, the coalition, uh, the forming of the coalition. And how is the, the cooperation among the three parties of the coalition? <laughs> Very good. You know, the other day uh, in uh, Kuala Lumpur, uh, some uh, Westerners, uh, Western correspondents uh, would like to know whether uh, Prime Minister Son San uh, attended, did attend the uh, third working session of our coalition government or not. According to some uh, correspondents, Mr. Son San was not present. I can assure you that he was, he was present. N'est-ce <laughs> pas? Son Excellence Son San était bien avec nous l'autre jour. And we should uh, communicate uh, uh, all together. The three leaders, Vice President Kyo Sopan, Prime Minister Son San and I, we signed the communique. <laughs> I, I don't know why uh, some uh, correspondents believed that there was no Son San. <laughs> Went elsewhere. You, you cannot have 
all His Excellency Deng Xiaoping, His Excellency Li Xianyan, His Excellency uh, Ye Jianying, His Excellency uh, Chao Ziyang, His Excellency Hu Yaobang, all together going to France, all together going uh, to uh, ASEAN. No, no, I impossible. You, you must understand. <laughs> you must understand. We are united. We are not divided. But we have uh, uh, to, 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 to divide our work. Il faut diviser le, le travail. On n'est pas divisé, mais il faut diviser le travail. <laughs> May I have one more yes, yes, please, at your disposal. Yeah. Would, would you please conclude your recent visit to Malaysia? Yes, my recent visit to Malaysia was uh, very successful. I had a very, very uh, nice uh, meeting, uh, very nice meetings, very cordial, very friendly with uh, uh, His Majesty the King, uh, with uh, His Excellency the Prime Minister of Malaysia, with uh, His uh, Excellency Tan Sri Ghazali Shafi. Uh, there was no problem. We did not uh, have uh, any discussion. Uh, I got simply their full support for my activities, the activities of the coalition uh, government, and uh, I um, uh, present the uh, assessment of the situation, military, political, diplomatic situation of uh, our uh, uh, Camp democratic Kampuchea uh, to the attention to uh, uh, the uh, um, uh, very distinguished uh, uh, Malaysian leaders and as far as the Asian uh, conference on the question of Palestine uh, was concerned, it was a tremendous success of Malaysia. The organization was perfect. Uh, everybody, all the delegations praised Malaysia and uh, your government and your foreign ministry. His Excellency Tan Sri Ghazali uh, Shafi uh, really uh, uh, was a perfect uh, chairman. Uh, we all uh, we were very happy, so uh, may we, uh, through uh, you all, uh, congratulate uh, once again uh, Malaysia. And uh, Malaysia also uh, represented uh, ASEAN, so may I congratulate ASEAN. I will put the, the last question. Yeah. That, uh, last Saturday, Thailand declared the formation of a new cabinet with uh, Frank Kijimalonda as the Prime Minister. Would you like to say some interesting words to this new cabinet? Yes, I have written uh, one letter to His Excellency Prem Tin Sulanon and another letter to His Excellency uh, Foreign Minister Siti Sabet Sila. I congratulate uh, them uh, very warmly uh, about the uh, forming of the new cabinet. Uh, in conformity with uh, the very high uh, and the wise uh, uh, decision uh, of uh, His Majesty the King of Thailand. Uh, we, uh, uh, Democratic Kampuchea, uh, it is, uh, we, 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 we are rejoicing, we, we, we are very, very happy, very enthusiastic about uh, uh, the decision of His uh, Majesty the King. Uh, uh, in conformity with the will of the uh, Parliament of Thailand to uh, uh, appoint once again His Excellency General Prem Tin Sulanon as uh, the uh, Prime Minister of the Royal Thai Government. And uh, we are very happy to see that His Excellency uh, Chief Marshal Siti Savet Sila is uh, 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 continuing uh, to uh, be uh, uh, the Minister uh, of foreign affairs of the Kingdom of Thailand. They are uh, staunch uh, uh, friends and supporters of uh, the Cambodian people and we, we feel extremely uh, encouraged by the fact that uh, there is stability and continuity uh, in the government uh, situa governmental situation, political situation of uh, Thailand. We admire very much the wisdom of the Thai, great Thai people uh, and uh, political parties, uh, they unite uh, in order to form very quickly the new government uh, that shows that uh, Thailand is very strong uh, and can uh, uh, make a tre more uh, tremendous progress uh, in every field. Uh, already Thailand is a, 
uh, developed countries uh, with a strong economy, is a very prosperous, uh, with a prosperous and happy uh, people. And uh, we are uh, so happy to see that uh, Thailand uh, is going to get uh, tremendous new success in every field of her national uh, construction. Uh, so uh, we congratulate very warmly uh, the new government under the leadership, uh, under the premiership of His Excellency General Premtim Sulanon. And we wish uh, the government of the, the Kingdom of Thailand uh, every success in every field inside Thailand and in the international arenas uh, because uh, uh, the uh, glorious success of Thailand uh, uh, we, 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 we get from such a success also advantages uh, to uh, uh, make progress uh, in uh, our way uh, towards uh, the national liberation, the complete liberation of our homeland. I feel greatly honored to present my credentials here today in liberated uh, territory of Democratic Cambodia to uh, His Royal Highness Samdev Narodom Sehanu. Uh, Pakistan, like uh, most nations of the world, upholds the rights of the people of Cambodia and is resolutely opposed to foreign military intervention here or in any other part of the world. So this presentation of credentials in these rather unusual circumstances is uh, a manifestation of our principled support to democratic Cambodia. We feel that the cause of peace in the world is harm when such interventions take place as here in Kampuchea or in Afghanistan. And uh, therefore we shall continue to join the rest of the international community in efforts to bring about solutions of these situations created by foreign military intervention. Thank you, Your Honor. One, one more, please. His Excellency, Mama, I don't, I don't, I don't, sir, I don't, I don't, I don't.
Without the help of Thailand, I cannot. <laughs> Conformity with uh, Islam uh, you, diet, you excellent. Chicken, only prawns, uh, chicken, and uh, we use oil, uh, vegetable. Uh, Vinegar, this Kampuchean, but only salt, salt and vinegar. Salt and vinegar. They're very dear to me. It is uh, very kind of His Excellency to say that uh, he hopes that one day we will be able to go to Phnom Penh to, together. But uh, I, I told His Excellency that uh, His Excellency uh, is fulfilling a glorious mission because you are <laughs> on the front line and near the front. integrity always always <laughs> we democratic Cambodia always <laughs> we, we we are with you and will be <laughs> with you very support you in every field and in particular when you defend your rights to take care of your health your life is very precious <laughs> You know, it is a tradition in Ruaya family of Kapuchi because we used to be. You know, General Nevin of Burma. When he, each time he need. So I, I, I. Uh, I gave you the example of General Nevin. My friend French is so no, <laughs> no problem. The madam can be better. In in China, yes, you prefer, yeah, because you cannot wait huh, for the. But you can have a checkup also in in Paris. You have a, you are doctors there also, Professor Hervé. No gynecologue, Professor Hervé, très bon, numéro un, et d'autres, très très bon. Thank <laughs> you. 
My son-in-law is accompanying me. Oh, thank you, thank you, Highness. But uh, your Excellency can take five minutes or so ten more uh, of rest to your Excellency. It's very successful, your mission, yeah, in, in the liberated zone. Thank you. Very successful. Thank you so much. Have rain. Once you are on the road, your highness, it doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> and it will help the struggle of the, Korea, the Cambodian people. So, our Thai brothers will take good care of your excellency. We are in very good hands. We are in very good hands. Are very good hands. <laughs> so happy, very honored. We look forward to the privilege of calling on you in Beijing. Aujourd'hui c'est bien, hein? il n'y a que les frères Thaï et Chinois. Hein? 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 